do your jugular vein and your carotid artery. If you know that those two things are in the neck region and that they're paired together, you'll be able to find them. So jugular vein, carotid artery. Coming from down from there, you want to be able to find your subclavian. Subclavian is going to tell you that it's heading into the arm region. So in here, there we are. you've got your subclavian vein as well as your subclavian artery. Big thing about subclavian, it's the only thing that you need to know for this course that's going to head into the arm region. From there, we get into the heart. You're going to find your anterior vena cava. In humans, this would be the superior. You find your posterior vena cava. It has a lot of membranes around it right now. You find your posterior vena cava, um, also known as your inferior, if this was a human. On the heart itself, you can find the pulmonary trunk. This is the one that comes across the front. Everyone always mixes this one up. So make sure you know that this is your pulmonary trunk and the aorta is actually back behind it. So this is your aorta back here. So pulmonary trunk, aorta is back behind it, your aortic arch. On the heart itself, you're going to have your cardiac veins. So right here, the cardiac vein is going to take blood from the heart muscle itself and transfer it back inside of the heart so that it can get oxygenated. You have your coronary arteries. Again, that's going to feed the heart the blood that it needs. So the red and the blue, pair those two things up together. Is it okay if I zoom in really quick? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so I'm just making sure I'm hitting everything as we go. Vena cava, vena cava, cardiac vein. All right, so our next area, we're going to do the renal. Renal is always going to tell you it has something to do with the kidneys. So with the renal artery and the renal vein, you're going to see them connecting from the vena cava and the descending aorta, and you'll find these two things heading right to the kidney. The blue is colored really nicely, the red uh, latex didn't quite make it all that far. On this side, oh, it's beautiful on this side. You're going to see renal artery is the red one, renal vein is the blue one other things we want to be able to find is we want to make sure that we can find our iliacs. It's still a little messy down in here, but here's our iliac. You have your iliac artery and your iliac vein, and these are the things that are right in here, and they're heading to the legs. So your best bet about going through this is to kind of group things together. You know if it's going to the legs, it's iliac. You know if it's going to the arms, it's subclavian. You know that if it's going to the kidneys, it's going to have to be renal. You know your jugular and your carotid are in the neck region. So lump them together, and it's going to help you to really get to know these well. So veins are blue and arteries are red? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. And I think that covered the whole list. Okay. Okay. Thank you. No